Well, I think it's officially time for us to say that time is no longer on our side. Folks, we gotta do some problem solving and fast. Cause the longer we let this go, the worse it's gonna get. So with that being said, welcome to episode 22 of our City Skylines playthrough. It's Morgoth the Barbarian here, and we are beginning to come down to the wire. This playthrough is supposed to end in the year 2073, and we're halfway through 2060. We're three quarters of the way done with this playthrough, and we haven't even crashed the uh, 200,000 barrier. We're supposed to be looking for a million dollars in weekly income. Uh, this is not a million. Not even close. It's not even a hundred thousand. It, it's trying to get there, but it's not really successful. Oh, there it is. Now we got six figures. Sure, right as I'm about to get off of that. Anyways, the last time we were here, we constructed the Eden Project in an attempt to get our land values throughout the city up. As well as take a few more uh, measures here. But we're at the point now where time is no longer on our side, and we need to try to think of some things. And if not, we'll get sent to our newly designed um, prisoner camp. I mean, a uh, nature reserve. That's totally what that is. Not a uh, terrible area. So we're going to try and do a couple things and see if it helps, as well as to try to develop what we can, so... Do you know what to do with YouTube and all that? And with that being said, let's see where we last left off. Because it ain't pretty. Well, remember I said we didn't haven't hit the 200,000? This is the highest I've seen it so far. So we're on the right path, whatever we did. But it's not looking good at all. We're still mucho behind. So... From a services standpoint, we're looking pretty good. Although, why did two buildings burn down to the ground? Alright, stop that. That's not funny. Your citizens are revolting, apparently. Okay. Oh. I don't know why, but for some reason we have a high amount of crime over here. The police still don't want to do their jobs. Tsk, tsk, tsk. Oh. There's literally a police station right next to you. Stop that. You know what? Get out of here. You're going to complain. That's what your fate lies. From now on, anybody that complains, they get sent to Oak Park, quote-unquote. Or is it? <laughs> I'm going to stare. <laughs> oh, it didn't work. How dare you, game? The game doesn't like that. Yeah, that's right. We now have a new detention center. <laughs> Fail to do your economic tasks, and you'll get to live in a tent. Yeah, that's right. We're no longer messing around. So, what can we do to rectify this situation? Well, let's start with one thing that actually may help. Trains. There's too many of them. They are all over the place. In fact, check this out. 72% traffic. That's supposed to be good, but you notice all the red on our rails. That is not supposed to happen, and I have tried endlessly to fix this issue. We've actually got some green over here, which is miraculous by itself. And the train superhighways aren't exactly working the way they should either. Ah, uh, at this point, it's probably too late to put more stuff in. What the hell? The power's going out over here. Yeah, isn't that lovely? I'm surprised the power isn't... Oh, because it's connected. Ah, oh, sweet. All right, let's get that out of here. We don't need that unsightly mess. Uh, but yeah... Are a couple things we need to clear the rails so one thing I'm going to do and this is a bit of a risk I'm gonna shut off a couple of um 
freight lines and see if that does anything or if it's going to cause all sorts of chaos. The very first spot I want to do it to is right over here, and it's not like, you know, there's a, a cargo port sitting right next to it. But to do this, I'm going to have to, you know, help compensate our uh, district over here. Unfortunately, past me kind of left a uh, little present over here. Of course he did. That's how past me loves the roll. He just does stuff and then assumes it'll be all right like later on in the game when in reality it's not oh see what i mean he, he just does stuff and then next thing and then we're stuff clean left stuck cleaning up the mess Ugh, i can't talk today isn't that wonderful Oh my goodness, I can't even build a highway out of here. That's not good. Alright, so we clearly can't build a highway out of here, but what about over here? I'm trying to... Yeah, the, the oil district is kind of the first spot I wanted to try this out on, but uh, once I... Again, yeah, past me, left a nice present for future, current me. While well, future me is currently stressing out over the whole thing. I might be able to pull it off. Excuse you, plane. Don't do that. Hmm. I think pa I think we've got some help here. All right. We, we're in business. And I don't know why I didn't have the curve on. Yippee. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Sometimes I just don't. There we go. It should help alleviate some things, but... Wait, is this an... There we go. Wait a minute! Hold up, I just noticed something kind of odd. You're kidding me, right? Wow, I didn't even notice that. That is, um... So this isn't even a real highway right now. Oh my god, that's uh, that's kind of embarrassing. Okay. <laughs> oh dear. I don't know how I did that. My oopsies. Is this all like this? What was I doing? Oh my god. All right, hold on a minute. I mean, it's not like traffic in this area is any bad. It's just kind of wild how I left this as a regular old two-lane highway, apparently. Which makes absolutely zero sense if you think about it. This shouldn't go take me too much longer. Hold on. Oh, okay, so eventually I ended it. It's just the parts where, you know... Okay, we fixed that problem. Apologies for that. I did not realize we were not taking advantage of um, the situation there. Jeez. Okay. You know, for traffic in the other direction. Now, I want to build this out first before we do anything. For... Okay. Because the plan is to close the, um... train highway that's over... the train station that's over there. Um, where, where was this coming from? Oh, yeah, I, now I remember. Sorry about that. I just had a moment there. 
Uh, that's not gonna work. Oh, passed me. What did you do? What did you do? And by that, I mean me from like five minutes ago. <sighs> all right, all right. Apparently this isn't working the way I expected it to. There we go. So that takes care of that, and that just leaves this one. Of course, there's like 20 million train lines I have to get over. Double check our work. Okay, we got that and that connected. Let's see, we have an exit there and an exit there. Excellent. So there we go. We got all that set up. And with that being said, where is our train line? Okay, so there's one cargo train station over here. There's two. You know what? Since there's an airport. You are both dismissed. We're going to just plain old shut them off and see what happens. My hope is that traffic will eventually turn around and suddenly realize there's this over here and start and either do one of two things, either rectifying all of the warning signs that are above this or end up just use straight up using the airport, which is kind of my hope. Uh, another thing we're going to do here, and this is kind of uh, awful. We're going to start charging tolls. You want to use the cargo bays, you're going to have to start paying up. This city is not built made of money. Oh, dear. Uh-oh. Can we even do that in the first place? That's my first next problem. That's a two-way booth. That's in booth. There's one problem number one. I think we can actually still do it, believe it or not. Okay, we kind of can, but this is very close. And then exiting this. Yeah, I want to start doing this for all of our passenger stuff. Of course, we got to crank it up to max. Why not? Why wouldn't we? Uh, at this juncture, I need to just, you know, fix some stuff over here. handle that and then same for over here we just needed some quick rearranging and that should do the trick there we go it all works out brilliantly so we can get rid of these power lines and restart the game so I want to do this for all of my airports and the cargo bay that's over there. So hold on for just a minute while I install those. Oops, wrong button. There we go. I'm call declaring this kind of a quote-unquote maintenance fee. 
<laughs> the reality is there ain't no such thing. I just want more money. <laughs> Speaking of which, let's just keep shutting down train stations. Uh, you're too small for one, so you're done. And again, the hope is that they'll probably go somewhere else. This one's just right next to a door to an airport, so I'd rather it go there. And then over here, we have one for the iron mill, two for this. You know what? You're done. Again, this is the tr attempt to reduce train traffic here. This is obviously going to throw all of our traffic on the roads, but that so be it. I'll keep this one open for right now, and this one open because it serves the iron district. And finally, this one, since you're so close, I'm actually going to shut you off. We'll leave the train stations as is for right now, but if it gets a little bit too crazy, we'll leave them on. This one I'll leave on since it's kind of far, and this and the airport doesn't really do anything. So, I'm going to see if all of this works. Uh-oh. Of course, it hits right in the one spot where we don't really have that much good fire coverage. Why not? There. So, the hope is that if we shut those down, it will kind of help. Um, does anybody use this? Or am I wasting my time just with this? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'm wasting my time with this. Okay, so this one, we're just going to straight up demolish. This one's done. I don't think that one's really doing anything. And you know what? What is this? Oh, we got to have those. Well, I'll demolish them for right now. Demolish the road, too. Don't necessarily need it. But we do need a new train line. The one that was um, connecting there. Otherwise, the trains are not going to get out. And there you go. And that didn't even do anything to fire or police. Excellent. Yeah, that train one was a waste of time. I, I, we're, 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 not gonna, we're getting rid of it if it has no use whatsoever. And then, of course, we've got our harbor district, which is uh, rocking and rolling. Uh, there's not really that many passengers, though. So, I won't be afraid to... Okay, the ships are down to 50. They're as low as they can possibly get here. All right. Although, does this affect this, too? Oh, Harbor and Ferry Depot. That's not going to really do anything. That means nothing. So again, the hope is that they'll use less roads. Excuse me, less rails and more... Well, unfortunately, it means more cars. But if it works the way I'm hoping it does... Then that'll help reduce rail traffic, which in return... Which is one of the reasons why we just simply can't make money here. Or as much as we should. I've, the highest I've seen is 190 right now. So we're falling so far behind. And 2060 is almost done. So is there anything else we can do in regards to cost-cutting measures? That's the next question. Well, let's see if anybody's importing anything. I'm staring at my industrial districts. That's kind of the issue. Oh, there you go. Although, not for nothing, we have all of this, and for some reason, it doesn't want to import it. I find that funny how we're importing stuff, yet there's all of this. Yet these guys are saying they can't find enough buyers. Okay, that makes total sense. Yippee. I mean, I could put another one of those till I'm blue in the face, but that's not going to solve any issues. So, we're going to move along on that. Oh, dear. Toll workers are thirsty. That's not good. Then they can't collect those tolls. I'm only going to leave it at the entrance, by the way. The exit, meh. We don't need to do that. We're not that insane. At least not yet. Let's see. 
you're still losing money, which is just nuts. I wonder why we can't get this up. Oh, visitors. Oh, wow. Look at that. It needs 2,500. No wonder. Um, you know what? I think what I can do, and this might help facilitate more usage over here. I'm going to build this underground, or at least attempt to. Ah, uh, game let us. Excellent. Build like an underground tunnel and connect it to that street right there. If I can do it correctly. Yeah, how about something like that? And then, of course, it we've kind of cut the power to it. But no, that's nothing new. There we go. Put in like a... So that helps facilitate, you know, usage of the... Um, Thingy Mabobber, the zoo. Whether or not it actually works, I don't know. But the zoo could use a few more customers. That is not what I wanted. Oh, man. Alright, that's the second time we've witnessed me using wrong roads, only this time we're freaking doing it incorrectly. Man, oh, man. Get with the program. Uh, that one actually works, so I'll just do that. Yes, yeah, so we got a new little district over here. Just in, for, for when we're ready. I'm not going to do it right now. We have no residential demand whatsoever. So there's no point in doing that. Okay. All we need for this to connect over here for our toll booth on the other side. There we go. There we go. You're fine now. Everything's fine. Okay. So what else can we do? What more are we going to be able to do or are we totally screwed here? I guess that's my first question. Well, these aren't working the way they should either. Just noticed that. The game just <laughs> informed me that that was a problem. Um, and if that's the case, these should probably go a bit further out then. They're probably coming back with... Oh, they're, oh yeah, they're not coming back with anything. That's not going to help, so... Just reconnect this. This is also giving us low efficiency, too, so I will bring this to the other side of the map. Other side of the lake here. And hopefully that's enough to fix the issue. There we go. See if that works or not. And then electricity, we're doing good. Water, we're doing good. Oh, sewage is getting close. No, oh, do we need another one? We do, don't we? Alright, just checking some of the basics over here, and then we should be all set. If it comes down to it, I will cut the budget of stuff. I'm hoping it doesn't lead to that sort of thing. I suppose another one would be okay. That's not what I'm hoping to have to do, so. In the meantime, we'll monitor rail traffic. It's funny, because I could hit the, um, nuke traffic button until I'm blue in the face. Hmm. You know what? Let's do it. This is going to be absolute insanity, but because I've done enough of it. Bye-bye, traffic. You've been dismissed. Oh dear, that was probably not the best thing I could have done, but here we are. I'm going to see if this whole works, though. So as we observe traffic over here... Oh, look at that. Yeah, there's no cargo bay you can go to. Yeah, try it now. 
Yeah, you deliver that to the petrochemical plant. You better. Yeah, that's right. That's where you should be going to, you jerks. Ah, oh, them. Always got to do this the incorrect way. <laughs> okay, this neat. Yeah, and of course we're now well in the hole, which is going to cause some grief, but... That's not an issue. Another garbage truck over here. This thing's complaining about that. What, the reason we did that was just to clear the rails over here. Okay, this needs to be cleared even more. As we did last game, we had some issues to zoning this whole area. So we had a few too many offices. So we're turning this into more residential stuff. Yeah, because we got no demand for industrial whatsoever. And on top of that, our parks are still... Huh. Gold one on investments is trying to survive. No, you're not. Get out. You get out, too. Let's we'll see if that works. But surprisingly, it's not affecting... <coughs> Excuse me. Our, our IT district as much, so... Anyways, we'll let that go. The traffic will, and the money will eventually come back. I'm not worried. We've had next to no industrial need all game long. The worker problem is still going on, unfortunately, as you can see. I'm hoping that fixes itself. We're up to 134 in the people department, meanwhile, which actually isn't that bad. Just, we, we need more of everything here. I mean, our resources are just not cutting it up. I don't think it's a traffic problem either. That's the crazy part. Um, You know, it's possible this whole setup, too, might be backfiring. Because there comes a point where you have to not have it do that. So I'm actually going to convert this into that and then build a new one. See if, is this possible this is, could be a traffic-related issue, too? Of course, if you pass me, decides to throw in a large oil pump over there. Because this wouldn't be perfect without me, past me, trying something. There. You happy now? Nice try past me. Get out of here. He just wants to like try to make it my life as miserable as possible. That's all it is. That's all this is, really. There. I'll leave that one as is. Actually, I wouldn't mind doing the same thing to a few other buildings in our district. Well, I should say roads, my bad. You know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, it's not. This isn't working the way I intended it to. All right. There we go. Because what if traffic just wants to throw more smoothly either? That's one of the issues, too. Like, this felt like a good idea from a conveyor belt standpoint, but maybe not. It wasn't the best option either. All right, pass me. What are you doing now? Huh, of course, you're leaving that there. Trying to build a road up to this, and you won't let me. Hmm. There we go. So maybe it's a partial traffic issue, too. So we'll see if that works. If it doesn't, now well, that's another problem by, it for its, by itself. Don't we have any more two-lane roads running around, do we? Oh, we have to. Again, I'd like to convert these to... There we go. Oh, okay. That's, of course. Go figure. Once again, leave it to pass me to kind of start stuff. There we go. Once again, leave it to pass me to try to start stuff again, as usual. 
He tends to do that. Let's see. Over here, we're looking pretty good. Not until, well, until I lied, we're not. Could be because I've gotten rid of a few things over here in the interim. There's not really too much more I could put stuff over here without really causing trouble. We'll put a couple more over here to try to boost some production, but no. Uh, All right, that's about as far as I can. the game will let me go. Wait, one more. All right, we, we got it. There we go. All right, so that's about as far as we can go. Uh, this district is basically full, so whatever happens, happens. Of course, it's our slaughterhouse that's not getting enough, but, you know, so be it. This is just a mess. We're ignoring that. This is not getting enough water. How are you not getting enough water? What the hell? Tisk, tisk, tisk. Okay. And then we're not getting enough crops over there, so we'll build a couple more large crop fields. Cough, cough. Just two. Nothing too serious. There we go. What on earth is going on over here? Alright. I know this isn't a perfect intersection, but I'll try it anyways. Wait, we don't need two lane roads. Okay, that's... Get, get out of the way. Bruh, get out of the way here. You too. Um... I'll upgrade it in just a second. I'll just put the roundabout in. First. Ah, love this roundabout builder tool, by the way. So hel helpful. All right. And then look at that. Traffic is already approving of it. Look at that. That didn't take too long for everything to, to go through smoothly here. Alright, that's still renowned. We have to figure out what we're missing still. I believe it's academic works. Alright, seems like traffic likes it, but with this being kind of the only way out, that's um, an issue by itself. Come to think of it, that is an issue. Um, you know what? Here, I'll do traffic a small little solid and build an out area over here. See if maybe that helps. Come on, you know you want to use it. Well, considering most of this is leaving the area, I would say probably not, but this is a... Consequence of that intersection. This one's not that better either. I mean, the traffic over here is trying. Some of this just wants to get to the flour mill, and some of this wants to go home to wherever building it went to. Do I have enough space to put another roundabout over there? That's my next question. We do and we don't. Well, we kind of do. But some jury rigging might help too, because that just looks awkward. There we go. Oh, we'll fix the traffic situation over here. There you go. You guys feel better now? Do you like a roundabout? Yes, you do. Uh, or maybe not. <laughs> Jesus. Look, I'm trying here, okay? I'm trying, but... They're still packing that, too. Oh, my God. Well, first off, the traffic doesn't know what it's doing. Good grief. I mean, I tr again, I tried to make this work, but it's just not. I hate to do this. 
We'll, we'll reopen that. It's possible traffic's trying to make a beeline towards the highway exit now that it realizes it's the only way out of here. So I guess we have to leave that open. That makes sense. This traffic over here looking decent. Well, not entirely. All right. Is train traffic any better now? Oh my god. Again, we cleared the, the the train tracks and this is looking so much better. So much better ever since we shut one of those down. It appears to be moving slowly, so what we were trying to do... Okay, it is academic works, that's fine. Ended up working out to a degree. What about over here? Has the effect kind of been... Well, not exactly, if you call it that, I mean... And we're right back to where we started, oh boy. Uh, no surprise, traffic's trying to take this, but I don't know where it's... Ex so a lot of this is exporting. Like, look at that. Exporting, export, export. It's all trying to export and get out of the map. What it doesn't realize is that there's demand for all of these products all over the place, so I don't think it even realizes, and that's why we still have import costs. They're not terrible, but this is not what I was looking for over here. Like, everybody wants to try to export the products outside of the city, when in reality there's, like, things that are screaming for stuff over here. I don't know if we just have simply have too many or not enough. It's very annoying me a lot. You know, we're almost to the brim over here, so maybe I'll put down like one more of each building and see if that calms it down a little bit. But this balancing act is not going very well, to say the least. There, we'll put some over here. Hopefully that solves the issue, but I doubt it will. There we go. So like I said, we'll see if that works. Oh, you're not doing very well still, but I'll leave it for right now. Exporting paper products. Okay, so we're getting some stuff over here. Um, Earlier I had a highway connection going over here. I'm wondering if we should revisit that. You know what? I think I will. We're going to have... Because I would like to connect this district up to the highway. Once again, we're doing just basically infrastructure projects. That can help our city out here a little bit. Do not know if this will work, work, or if it'll be an absolute abject failure. So this will be kind of the exit. All right, we can't, we gotta back that up a little bit. Okay, fine. <laughs> That's not what I want to be doing, but eh, so be it. I know that is. They you know what? That's a little bit too steep. Now that I'm looking at it. There 
we go. That's a lot better-ish, but not really what I'm looking for. And then we'll start the other one right about here. So this one... Okay, well now we gotta switch the direction on this. And then one for you as well. And there you have it, there we go. Now we got a connection over here too. Now stuff from our tree district can end up leaving efficiently. I'd like to do repeat the same exercise over here. So they can try to use more of our highways. So once again, I see it past me kind of what nuts, although that could have been current me too. Let's not let him off the hook either. Yeah, that's exactly where I want to put it too, and there's no easy way to... We'll throw the cattle shed over here. That's easy enough. You, you gotta get moved. Well, you're just straight up getting deleted. How about that? So, same exercise over here. Only this time, you may notice we have a little bit of a problem. Build this out a little ways and then just adjust it as time goes on. And then this one. Ah, of course we build once again with the whole warehouse yard kind of thing. Oh, of course. Commercial zone goods? What? What? Get out of here. Pass me. What are you doing? You are losing your mind here would be the first time, won't be the last. <laughs> this one will build on the opposite side of the highway. Um, that's where it's got to go. Alright. That's not what we're looking for, though. Alright. There we go. That's the best I can do. Close enough. And then I guess, I think the only thing we're missing is, yeah, we're missing this. Wait, ah! Oh, because we already have something there. As long as it can go over the train line, we're good. And, uh, we're not there yet. There we go! We get it. Save the city. Not really. Well, now we really didn't save the city. What the hell? Ah, 
All right, that's better. I'm gonna rewrite that. There we go, and now it looks a lot better. Uh, let's see if I can try to put one more farm thing over here, and then we're all set. Oh yeah, we're good. Nope, two more. Now we're good. All right. Excellent. This works out, you know, the best we can. Oh, of course, you're all going to use that train station. You know what? No, no, no. Not anymore. You're done. Well, we'll keep it only because the train traffic isn't terrible. But yes, I get, I'll give my traffic another option, too, and that's to use this highway. Oh, see, look at that. Some stuff is already exporting stuff. And actually, we'll conclude this. By upgrading this road here, too. I don't think that... Both our roads over here. I don't think it's doing us any favors. The median really isn't doing us any favors. If I can get rid of that, that'd be great. We can leave this as is. There's nothing issue wrong going there. There we go. Now we gave our traffic a few more options to, that hopefully will make exporting a little bit easier as well as clear up some of our supply situations that are going on. What are we ha doing dealing over here? Not enough goods to sell. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, that's never a good thing to see. Bruh. Not enough goods to sell. How dare you. Let's fill in a few more areas, and I think we should be all set. There we go. Alright, now we're all set. We fill in this last little area over here next to the sneaker factory. And we're all basically all set. I know we also have a highway interchange over here, too. But now we've given traffic a few more options to utilize. So, And, of course, they're all trying to go to the cargo port because why wouldn't they? Why wouldn't they? <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. So yeah, we're now a year into this. We're at 2061, so... Fortunately, we didn't, weren't really able to upgrade too much of the city too much. Um, I guess from this point forward, I honestly don't know what more we can do at this point. We're running out of time, unfortunately. We're at 2061, and we've got 12 and a half more, 11 and a half more years left. It's not going very well, so I guess for right now, what I'll do off camera, see if I can try to fix a few more things. Oh my god, that's hilarious. And I guess I'll end this playthrough by upgrading this episode, I should say, by upgrading our nature preserve even more. As it now just got upgraded to a little... As it now just got upgraded to a level, you know, two. Awesome, you'll have to see it. Fine, I'll put some camping sites over here. In our detention center. <laughs> As I said earlier, if you don't meet your quotas, you're going to get thrown over here. Alright, and it ain't going to be pretty. That's the rules. I, I don't make... Look, I don't make the rules. Oh, wait. Yes, I do. <laughs> Excuse me. There. That's right. Go look out at the train tracks. Yeah, that's right. Endlessly stare at the train tracks and see what you've done. In fact, you know what? I'll put a couple more over here. <laughs> oh, man. There's nothing wrong with living in a tent. With getting sentenced to living in a tent. 
Is there? Is there really? Some campfire sites. I mean, they can cook things over a fire. Hopefully no um, ideas come about. Yeah, there we go. See, it works. <laughs> and you know what? We can even have night tours. Oh, should I have them shoot off fireworks? That would be hilarious. <laughs> nah, we're not going to do that. We're not terrible. All right, so that's going to conclude this episode. We're up to 150. Just cannot break that 200,000 barrier whatsoever. So I'm going to see what else I can do here. We'll report back and hopefully everything. We'll come up with some more ideas on what we could possibly do. So as always, thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one. As we are getting down to the very end, this is going to come down to the wire. Brace yourselves. It's going to get wet, wild. It's going to get really, really wild. Wild. Bye.